Okay guys, we're back. Let's finish up these uh, uh, cone flowers. I got the three amigos watered in. Now we're going to divide out these three sangritas. You can see I've already got it dug up. I had it planted. I've dug it up. It's still, roots are still in good shape. Be easy to divide. You can see there's three in here, three plants. And also, I don't know if you can see that, but since it's laying here, even the bees just, even with it laying here, they just want it. <laughs> They're loving this. So I'm going to divide this one out. Uh, they just kind of fall apart, really. fell out of there. We'll put one right here. Get the glove back. Glove on. Not that it's gonna keep me from getting dirty. So that's gardening joy playing in the dirt, right? So we'll get this one here. Get it planted up here high. that one and now let's take one of these yellow ones and put in here with this actually I think I'll put uh, Yeah, I think I'll go ahead and put one of the yellow ones in here behind it. <laughs> that just lifted right out of its spot, guys. Easy peasy. No problem whatsoever. Let me readjust the camera here for you. So you can see. There's some some rail sangrita. Here we'll dig these out. See, they just got three in here. I mean, it's there's three plants in there, so it works out very, very well. Plant them two feet apart, supposedly, and they've got these in here. So falling apart. <laughs> Easy peasy. Put this one back here. Well, I'm going to have to change the camera here and I'm going to have to change my position because I can't get to it. There is the next uh, I'll put this this one here. but like I've said before many times in my videos I'm always moving things around all right so there's those here let me see says plant them like two feet apart yeah. <laughs> I got them a foot according to my bore bore knife so obviously I've got them too close I'll be changing those in the years to come All right, now let's take all the goodies. Take you 
guys. And we will, I don't know if you can see that honeybee still trying to get on these. And Greed is laying here, better get as he got on there. or not there. Got pollen all over his leg too. Sorry for the noise. There's a a uh, tree service up about four houses down the street from me. Somebody's having a couple of trees removed I think. But set up here. Uh, grab See my little toad house there. It's not really a toad, but it's not functional. It's just a mushroom house, I guess I should call it. Just I wish these doors did work. I wish there was a way for frogs, for toads to get in there. Alright, let's divide this one. So I think well, the tag on this Sangrita says zone four to nine. So it did, the tag on there did have a zone on it. And I think that's the way it is with all these Sombrero series. And I'm not positive, but I think the Sombrero series is proven winners. Yep, it's the uh, nursery that developed it. I'm not positive about that. I'll look it up and see. Just stack in here. There we go. Still seems to be wanting to lean a little. I have it planted too high. We'll see. And this yellow one, by the way, is called Sombrero Lemon Yellow. I don't know if I've said that yet. But look here at the bees already covering these, and I just got them in the ground. There's that little honeybee, a couple of bumblebees. They're loving these plants. Uh, now we're going to go to another location. Sorry for the camera work. Like I've said before, uh, I don't know how these gardeners, these YouTube people <laughs> that uh, do it all themselves as far as moving stuff around and everything. I don't know how you get it done, but I'm learning. I'm getting there. So we're going to put this red one right here. I'm good, how are you guys? Very good, come here Eli. Hey, I will come back and chat. Okay. We are going to the, uh, uh, the Asian Lantern Festival. Okay. And I haven't had a shower yet. And I'm Same supposed, here. I'm supposed to be there at five. Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, God, they love you. Uh, <laughs> hey, Millie. Stop. Hey, Millie. Okay. okay. I'll come say hi.
Sorry for the up. Oh, says my battery's low. Uh, let's see here. All right, guys, battery's getting low. Sorry for the interruption there. Battery and I uh, had a neighbor come by with a couple of her pets, Millie and Eli. A couple of those called four line, four legged feline friends had to say hi and they caught me by surprise I didn't see them coming so I would have adjusted the camera for that so I'm sorry for the delay or for the uh, interruption now we're gonna put this third sombrero uh, sangrita right here and this is more of a uh, rock garden environment right here because it's on a very steep very steep hill and uh, see how it does here compared to the other places all right Let me get some more soil to mound up against it I've got it planted so high it doesn't want to stay there. This is all mulch, so I don't want to pile mulch up against it. All right. So there's that. Sorry for the choppiness of this video, guys, and the uh, unprofessionalism. Not that I'm a professional photographer or video guy. <laughs> now we're going to put uh, get these two lemon yellow in the ground. Put one of them right back here. About fell down there, guys. Sorry. Please ignore all the weeds in this bed. Uh, haven't gotten to it yet. Uh, got weeds everywhere. And I hope that's a good, yeah, that's a fairly good spot, I think. Yeah, right there. So take these. That one pulled apart very easily put some dirt back in the hole it's too deep still a little deep <laughs> okay that's better now let's break all this up to weeding this bed. Hopefully this one makes it. It's, I don't know what you can tell in, that ca in the camera, but this was a little <laughs> piece of that little one out of there. Out of those three, although it's loaded with booms. Uh, get these watered in. All right, got one more. And then we'll end this marathon of a video hope you guys are having a great day and please subscribe hit the like button I know I got a lot to learn a long way to go with my video skills there's the dahlias I don't know if you can see that uh, we're going to put this other yellow one right here all this mess over here again sorry for poor camera work uh, 
tilt you down a little bit more. Not quite that much, maybe. There we go. I'm going to put this one in this hole right here. Very steep incline here, so all of the soil fell down the hill. So I'll grab onto my cap or my hat. Very sticky little flower buds or cone flowers there. Cones. Right now. Spread the mulch over it. Oh, yeah. Got a little inchworm on it. <laughs> over here on this side. All right, now. All right, guys. There's all those in. I got to get them watered in. Thanks for watching. I'm sorry for the longevity of the video, and I'm sorry for the uh, scatteredness of everything. Sorry that I'm out of breath. Sorry for the noise down the street. Somebody's giving you a couple trees removed, I think. I don't know if I've said anything about that yet or not. Maybe I did. Have a great day, guys. A blessed evening and a terrific weekend. This is Friday here when I'm shooting this. I don't know when I'll get it published. Maybe today. We'll see. Uh, but anyway, thanks for watching. Have an awesome day. Please hit the subscribe, the thumbs up, and the notification bell. Talk to you later, guys. Have a good one. See you in future videos, hopefully.